sex talk. <laughs> Can you explain yourself why you up this hey. early? <laughs> why you up this early? Any explanation? <laughs> to the official morning, I been woken up by allergies, I guess. This is the only downfall of spring and pollen and trees. <clears throat> and one of my asthma triggers is allergies. So, as you can tell, I'm short as a breath. Here we are. Yeah, I need to get in, uh, what is it called? Cyn Cytosin? No. Certec? One of my allergy meds. But obviously, this time around, I'm nursing, so I have to make sure that I can take it while I'm nursing. It's just chilling. Really? Oh. <sighs> but yeah, I already take my apple medication, so it should kick in real short in here. But again, it's going to be out of it again until I get this asthma allergies control. Anyways, I'm up very early in the morning. It's Saturday, March 3rd. I'm going to go ahead and edit um, Wednesday's vlog. Yep, Wednesday and barely. I'm so behind. I didn't vlog yesterday for the same reason because I'm behind. But I did upload Tuesday's vlog, so I kind of just vlogged. I'm vlogging today. Jose <sighs> Stephanie are still asleep. Uh, I'm going to woke up. I was actually asleep, but... I nursed her and then she stayed awake. Oh, now you want to fall asleep. Huh. Now you want to fall asleep? <laughs> yeah. What are you yelling about? Huh? Huh? <laughs> Bless you. <laughs> By the way, you guys, I already have my coffee. I mean, it's been done. I've been drinking it. It's 12 ounces. I did two six and six. Yes, girlfriend. Yes. <laughs> Current situation right now. I got her like a football so I can go ahead and add it and have my arms free. Mom wife. <laughs> she grabs onto my shirt like super tight. Like, you ain't going nowhere, mama. Like, she is so tight on her. Like, she's going to fall asleep soon. It's already 7.06, so she's been up since 5, so the longest she can stay up is 2 hours before she passes out. That's exactly what I'm, what she's doing. Oh my god, I still have this nail polish. <laughs> so I'm going to go ahead and continue editing, and around 9 o'clock, I'm going to get Stephanie up if she's not up. Get her ready for a doctor's appointment. I go more into deep, more in depth than that later on, but it's no bueno. Like, no bueno. You have to sleep? Uh -huh. Oh. Did you have a good dream or a bad dream? What's your dream? I don't know. What do you mean you don't know, silly? I really can't wait. No, uh, I just want to go put her down and see if she falls asleep, but... Oh, my goodness. Mommy has allergies. <clears throat> oh, you want to use my iPad? Uh -huh. <laughs> oh, I love you. What do you want for breakfast? How many? Three. Three? Wow, you woke up hungry this morning. Alright you guys, Emily was falling asleep after nursing her, so I'm gonna go lay her down and see hopefully she falls asleep. Wow, she's wide awake. <laughs> I said, try to guess. Do. So, like, somebody else has allergies. We're going to the doctor today, you know that? I think your appointment is at 10 50, 10 30. I have it on my phone. So, we can know what time. Okay? So, we gotta get some good breakfast. How's that sound? Ooh, you sound sleepy. <laughs> Alright, Emily doesn't show any signs of sleeping, but also is not. Complaining yet, so I want to go ahead and leave her there. She's sucking on her thumb. She's probably self-soothing right now, um, but she's doing fine. Uh, Stephanie's waffles are in the oven. Yesterday, I completely cleaned Stephanie's room, cleaned my room, cleaned the living room, so there's pretty much nothing to do besides laundry-wise. But also, yesterday I did somewhat laundry, but still have some laundry today. 
But I'm going to go ahead and finishing up the vlog and I'm going to go get my iPad really quick. By the way, I got an iPad. Well, I've been having uh, an iPad mini, but I sent it in and I got a new one. And this is like the new 9x7 iPad. Is that the iPad? Yeah. And 32 gigs. Just like the, the iPad the mini. Is the iPad but just... in there? No, mama. And um, I only had to pay 59 bucks, I believe, basically, um, to kind of get it different. Don't talk to Emily, okay? Because she's going to get super excited. She does that. She gets so excited and she wants to be carried. And she starts kicking and whining and baby talking. But, um, yeah, I that's what I did. I've been having mine for five years and I need to be replaced. So, I got it. Um, come sit over here. There's no games in that iPad, Mama. I know. I wanted to watch YouTube. Will you watch good stuff on YouTube, okay? I just open this. Right here. That's hard. What is one? Oh, the message. Message on your iPad? No, I have my Facebook connected to you. How? Just until your waffles are ready, okay? And Emily is now complaining. <laughs> Mama! Are you not going to fall asleep or what? <laughs> Barrigona. Hey. 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 Go na na. Andale. Me me say. Yeah, you want to go to sleep? Yeah? Shh, shh, come on, go to sleep, okay? <laughs> Story of my life with two kids. I'm going to take a shower, but I want her here, and I want her here to make sure she doesn't get into anything, so... Hi! Where's your blanket? Did you bring your blanket? No. Hi! Hi! Alright, I'm going to take a shower now. Look how messed up it looks. It's like, I don't know. It's like, 
I should have just gone with my hairstylist and just done it with her instead of being like so impatient and going somewhere else. She messed up my hair. Like my ponytail, it's not even. Oh my god, my hair is growing that fast. My ponytail is not even the way it's supposed to be. I don't like it. This is why I don't cut out my hair anymore. You guys remember when I used to do it all the time, my hair was longer? Because it was good. Now it's not. It's like ugh, hideous and ugly. I don't like it. Tiffany, she has a dream with unicorn. Unicorn, mama? Oh, dream with your heart shirt and then her uh, dark jeans and then her own dad's my towel from the shower her navy old navy shoes with a yellow bow and then Emily's already ready I got her ready like an hour ago and there's her and then she was very fussy so I put her in a swing and she ended up passing out but she is out I'm ready her 70s appointment is at 10 50 I think I'm gonna leave the house at 10 30 and it's only let me see. It's only 10.17, so uh, probably like in 10, 11, 12 minutes more. We'll head out. But uh, yeah, I'm ready. Dive ready, ready. Jose works all day today. Like literally, completely all day. He won't be back till 11 o'clock at night. He has two jobs. So he's, in, he's working right now at 1. When he gets out, he's going to come home, take a shower, and get dressed for his second job and go. So poor guy. He's out all day, but... He's off next Saturday and next Tuesday all day. It's just a crazy routine. But yeah, I guess we're just going to go hang out. Um, actually, I'm going to go ahead and... Well, the reason why I told you guys that he works all day is because I'm going to go to a mom's house and probably be there all day because I don't want to be here all day. Hey guys, I forgot my camera upstairs. I'm still here though, but I already have Stephanie buckling. I'm already buckling myself. Well, I'm already buckled. Emily's already in her car seat. It's already 3.40. I'm not going to go back upstairs. So, um, I'm currently on my phone. Not surprised. I mean, it's okay. That's how I started with my phone. So, I told you guys that I was going to take Stephanie to the doctor. Didn't tell you guys why. Here's the situation. All week in school, she had accidents. All week, all week, all week, all week. I sent her in with outfits. Sometimes I even had to go in a second time to take her a second pair of outfit. It's just what the heck, you know? So, um, I talked to the counselor yesterday, Friday, and we tried to come up with the conclusion, the solution, like, what's going on, you know, why are there so many accidents, are you scared, are you afraid, what is it? So, <coughs> she said that she pees on herself because she wants to go home, she doesn't want to be in school, and we're like, okay, maybe that's it, but yesterday, we were at my mom's house, and she had an accident, so I picked her up, and I said, okay, that means you want to go home, so let's go. She goes, no, no. I don't want to go home. I'm like, that's what you told the principal and the counselor. He said that every time you have an accident, it's because you want to go home. And it turned out that I brought her home. She was crying, throwing a tantrum because she didn't want to go home. So I told her, then what's the issue? Why do you pee in school then? Because you told the counselor and the principal that you pee because you want to come home. And I didn't get any out of it. She was just upset that we had to come home. So I had already scheduled the appointment on Wednesday. I already called the doctor and I told her, hey, you know, I need to see you ASAP. But I didn't want to make Stephanie do school, so I was like, do it on Saturday. So here we are Saturday. Gonna take her in, get her tested. Hopefully it's not a urinate, urination. Hopefully it's not a urine tract infection because her teacher said, I let her go, mama. A minute and a half later, two minutes later, she is, miss, miss, can I go to the restroom? And it's like, what the heck, you know? And sometimes it's, it's crazy. Now, the most shocking thing is that yesterday, Friday, she had an accident. And it wasn't a number, it wasn't P, it was a number two. And... It was a shocker to me. I started C-A-R-Y because it's just stressing me the heck out. You know, I was sick and tired of it. I mean, all week I had to drive up to the school. All week I had to send her extra pair of clothes. And then she would use the extra pair of clothes. But then she would, you know, have an, have an accident in her extra pair of clothes. So then I had to take her more extra clothes. So I had to go, like, out of my way to take her and go to her school. And it was just... It was just so stressful, you guys. I mean, extremely, extremely stressful and very sickening and tired. So I decided to call the doctor. We're going over there right now. That's currently the update, and I'm now at a red light. So that's currently the update. Um, we're going to see what's wrong. Hopefully, it's not a urine tract infection. We just can't get Stephanie to go to the restroom. I wanted to learn about this.
Are you gonna pee? We need you to pee here. Why? Because we need to see. But now I already pooped now, it's gonna take a long time again. Alright, so I don't know how to explain this without being so TMI, but I'm just going to go flat out. So the thing is that there were accidents and they were not on purpose. She is constipated. Um, urine track infection, I mean the urine test came back great. She's good. She doesn't have no infection. The nurse touched on her stomach and literally, literally five seconds in and she goes, oh yeah, she has a bunch of poop. Like she has poop. So all that poop was pushing on her bladder was making her pee all the time. Cause the doc the teacher even said, I'm like, I don't understand, mama. I let her go a minute or two, she wants to go again. You know? And it's not even a little bit, you guys. When she would have accidents, it was I mean, it would get into her socks. That's how much she would pee, you know? So, um, it's not an infection she said what happened was she is very constipated and all that poop is just sitting on top of her bladder and she said the good thing is that we came on time or else she can have had an infection that thing could have just bursted inside and they would have the poop mess all inside and that would have not ended pretty so she sent me some medication some powder that I have to put in her Gatorade her drink basically make her drink it and it will make her poop a lot now she hasn't yesterday she pooped by at school and since then she has not wanted to go to the restroom like it's a shocker that so far today she's only been to the restroom twice and it's already 11 45 so i think that's probably what it was because she would never ever pee on herself she never i mean pooped on herself she never ever poops on herself never like it was never ever since she's she was a baby, not a baby, ever since she's been potty trained. She has never, ever had a poop accident. And it was kind of like a what the heck moment. I asked her, do you poop at school? And she doesn't. She's shy to poop at school. What am I like? Yum. Okay, you make sure you go to the restroom when you need to, okay? Mm -hmm. Thank you. Look. This is so fat. <laughs> Hi guys, today in Julie and family. Oh wait, your channel's not called that. Yes it is! It's oh, it not is? called Our Daily Journey. Oh, I like Our Daily Journey better. I'm outside with Emily, but I got her under the blanket because the wind is kind of just. Can I get her some fresh air? Where is my sister? It's a little bit windy, but I'm trying to get her to sleep, some fresh air. I'm watching the kids out here. This dog looks upset because we're not rocking him. Huh, the other line. There are the kids. There's Stephanie, and there's Felita, and for those of you asking, those two are my siblings. Those, that is Stephanie's aunt, that is Stephanie's uncle. Crazy, huh? She's in her stroller. I never put her in the stroller by herself. I always put the car seat, but this time we're outside. <clears throat> by the way, I'm here because Jose works all day, so I'm just staying here all day. They're having a cookie. I'll show you guys right now. But yeah, I'm outside with Emily on the stroller. I'm having a cookie all over the air. As you can see, but I have this to stop the smoke to come to Emily, and she's currently was looking at the clouds. <laughs> Oh no, what is it, Mama? <laughs> what? Hi, guys! It's me, Miranda. Stop messing with my chicken. Did you just take a bite of my chicken? Give me that. <laughs> Give me that. That's my chicken. Damn. Hi, guys. So, um, that's my chicken. Can you slow mo that? <laughs> mm hmm. 
slow-mo that shit. Nah, <laughs> Let's recreate the thumbnail for that, the other video. Oh, we're wearing the same shirt. All right, you guys, it is 9.53, and we are now heading over home. No. Um... I know where else we're going. We're gonna go stop by Jose's job real quick and just get him a stop by. But after that, we're going home. But we'll probably just be there for like five minutes, probably. Because Stephanie hasn't seen I'm him in all day. But, uh. I'm tired. I just wanna get home and get ready. Just go to bed. Alright, you guys, back into business. Back with the camera. I'm going to take Emily a bath. I was going to take her a bath this morning, but we have some appointment at 10.50 in the morning, and I didn't want to take her out this morning. Go ahead and take this little one a bath. Yeah. You want a bath, mama? Yeah. yeah. By the way, Stephanie came home, crashed. She's done. She's out of it all day today in the playground, my mom's house. She's just out. She completely crashed out. So... I'm gonna go ahead and take her bath. Where is my phone? It's in the diaper bag. She doesn't know what time it is. It is. Ten thirty-six. This girl come lay down. She's going to lay down. <laughs> Get up, you lazy butt. There we go. All right, I'm gonna go get her in the bath. All fresh and clean, and I was looking for the boob. Okay, let's change. 